In today's video, we are going over how to use the Maxima Semi-Auto Heat Press. A must-have add-on will be an air compressor. We will be using the California Air Tools compressor. Once you have the proper connection, go ahead and connect the air holes here. After everything has been properly placed, turn the air compressor on. You will notice that the heating element is now raised. Make sure your Maxima Semi-Auto Heat Press is connected. Power requirements are going to be 110 volts. Then turn the machine on by switching the red switch in the front. On the left side of the machine, you will see this switch. This switch controls which mode the heat press will be on. The three modes are semi-auto, standby, and manual. When the switch is turned to the left, it is on semi-auto mode. In this mode, the heating element will automatically go down once the sensor is triggered. There are sensors on both sides of the machine, so the heating element will go down just by moving it all the way to either side. To enter manual mode, you will turn the switch all the way to the right. In this mode, to lower the heating element, you will have to hit the green start button. The heating element will stay down for the inputted time. If at any moment you need to raise the heating element before the time finishes, you can do that by pressing the emergency stop button on the right hand side of the machine. To change the temperature and the time, you can do this from this touchscreen panel here. First press this button, then adjust the parameters using the up and down arrows. You can do the same for the other side. To lower and raise the pressure of your heat press, you will turn this knob here. Turning it clockwise will increase the pressure, and turning it counterclockwise will decrease the pressure. At the end of your production day, simply turn off the heat press before you disconnect the air hose. Make sure your air compressor is empty. If you have a California Air Tools compressor, you can do this by pulling this valve. You will know it's safe to remove once the gauge reads zero on the pressure. Disconnect the hose. You will notice that the heating element will lower to a resting position and that's it for how to use the Maxima Semi-Auto Heat Press. Thanks for watching.